Oh my lord, oh my god, what's up guys? Uh, we have some big Halloween news. CinemaCon, uh, I guess some new footage has been shown. I'm gonna go and read the reports, maybe some possible Twitter posts. Uh, I'm shaking right now, holy crap. Because I'm shaking because we don't know anything yet. There's been theories upon theories, you know, the radio tower could be, some, who knows? But we don't know anything. It's been four years. Where the hell is Michael Myers? Nobody knows, but CinemaCon, literally like right now, CinemaCon is happening. I don't know if Jamie Lee Curtis, uh, I know she took the panel. I don't know if they're finished with the panel, but I'm going to tell you what I know so far, okay? Wow. Take a deep breath, Lee. Holy shit. So I guess first thing, let's go to Bloody Disgusting, because I know there's, there's an article with Bloody Disgusting. Am, is my sound even on? Yes, it is. Okay. All right. So let's go to bloodydisgusting.com. There we go. Okay. I have Bloody Disgusting pulled up. Uh, first Halloween ends footage shown at CinemaCon reactions hit social media. This is by John Squires. He says, the very first look at David Gordon Green's Halloween Ends was shown off during Universal CinemaCon presentation tonight, but it will be a bit before we get any footage online. In the meantime, we do have at least some social media reactions from those in attendance at CinemaCon tonight. We also have some new comments from star Jamie Lee Curtis. Whoa. Okay, here we go. On the CinemaCon stage tonight, the horror icon promised that Halloween Ends is Laurie Strode's last stand. This is it, this is it for Laurie Strode. Whether you like it or not, it's over, it's over. And from this point forward, who knows where the franchise could go. Let's read on. Uh, on the CinemaCon stage tonight, the horror icon promised that Halloween Ends is the last. Let me read that again. On the CinemaCon stage tonight, the horror icon promised that Halloween Ends is Laurie Strode's last stand. And that the movie is going, and I quote, gonna fuck you up. She said that it's gonna fuck you up. Okay, uh, check out some Twitter reactions at the CinemaCon footage below. Trust me, it's gonna fuck you up. Jamie Lee Curtis before introducing, so that's from CinemaCon. Okay, Rebecca Rubin says, Jamie Lee Curtis jokingly shaded the audience at CinemaCon because they didn't give her a standing ovation. In Halloween Ends, Laurie Strode and Michael Myers meet for the last time. Trust me, it's gonna, we read that, she promises. The trailer is legitimately terrifying. Rebecca Rubin, the trailer is legitimately terrifying. Okay, cool. Scott Menzel says, the trailer for Halloween Ends serves as a tribute to the legacy of Laurie Strode and Michael Myers. Fans of this franchise look like they are in for a real treat. As the franchise comes to an end, the trailer looked awesome. Hashtag CinemaCon. So, we know that there's probably some kind of big confrontation between Laurie Strode and Myers uh, at the end. I'm not saying that's what it says here, but you know, they saw like a trailer. There will be a major confrontation, okay? Major. Uh, uh, Steven Weintraub says, first trailer for Halloween Ends uses footage from all the film to tie everything together, all the films to tie everything together with Jamie Lee Curtis fighting Michael Myers for the last time, thumbs up. We got a thumbs up. Flick Direct says three fourths of the trailer shown Halloween, the remake and Halloween ends. The final part was an amazing all out brawl between Laurie and Michael. Wow. Why does he say remake? Three quarters of the trailer shown Halloween, the remake. I think he's talking about Halloween 2018. Okay, uh, Eric Davis says we just got a first look at Halloween ends featuring a wild brawl between Lori and Michael in a kitchen, fighting back, or fighting each other. Michael throws Lori across the room. Lori grabs a knife and stabs Michael through the hand. It ends with Lori holding a knife over a trapped Myers. I got you, motherfucker. Oh my God, this is gonna be insane. This is gonna be insane. John Roca, uh, Outlaw Nation, he says, playing us a great reel of Lori Strode's ride through Halloween with some scary, gory, and insanely brutal scenes for Halloween Ends, including an awesome confrontation between her and Michael Myers. It's time to do a rewatch of these to get ready for this one on October 22nd. Rewatch of what? Halloween 2018 and Kills? Are you talking about one of the other 10 different 
timelines in the franchise. Rohan Patel says Halloween ends footage is highlighted by a brutal fight between Laurie Strode and Michael Myers and it ends with Laurie stabbing through the hand, blah, 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 same thing, okay. So finishing up, Halloween ends is dated for theatrical release October 14th. David Gordon Green has recently teased that there will be a four year time jump from the events of kills to the events of ends. And it's said to be more uh, intimate and contained. Okay, um, I guess final thoughts, you know, we got this footage out, final thoughts. I might have to do a big stream on the, and yes, I, we're still trying to work out a hollow stream. It's the schedules, we're trying to get everybody's schedules together, but I might have to do a stream on this, uh, maybe this Friday night or something like that. Uh, just to talk about expectations, to talk about um, why I think the fact that the, the franchise has so many timelines has actually kept the franchise afloat. Like I was actually thinking this today, like what if, what if 12 movies and they all stayed in the same continuity? Would it have petered down gradually and then just faded into oblivion? Maybe the constant change up has what's kept the franchise afloat. So we'll talk more about that on the, uh, the live stream. Um, probably this Friday night, like I said, but, uh, yeah, we finally have some footage, nothing crazy, just a, a fight scene. We don't know, uh, anything else outside of that. Um, uh, and, and as much as I love Halloween kills, I'm glad this one is going to be more contained and not be the, the town of Haddonfield, but I'm so curious about the ending. Okay. The ending of this movie. I mean, this scene could take place in the first, um, first act of the movie. This could be first act stuff. Who knows? You know, I kind of hope it is, if I'm being honest. Wouldn't that be cool if the big showdown is in the first act and then maybe he gets away or something like that? Who knows? Um, yeah, really curious, though. There is the uh, the first reactions to Halloween Ends CinemaCon. So anyway, let me know down in the comments. Does this make you a little bit more excited for Halloween Ends or do you even care at this point? Because I know there's been a lot of mixed reactions to the previous two movies. I... Uh, I, I'm really excited. I am. I'm really excited. But I happen to be a freaking Michael Myers fanatic, okay? So that doesn't help my case. Anyway, be sure to come over to Killer Flicks where we talk horror all day and every day and on Fridays. We do free for Fridays. Follow me at Drum Dums on my socials. Support me on Patreon. Buy me a coffee. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day and Drum Dum out.